All right, we're gonna do Parmesan crusted walleye today. So to get this going, we put our Ritz crackers into a gallon bag. That way they don't go everywhere when you smash them up. Makes it a lot easier. Seal that up. Just kind of pound them to start. We're going to put this into the bowl. Beautiful. Then we're going to add our Parmesan. Now I got a third cup of fresh grated Parmesan. Just toss that in there. You don't want it to overpower your fish. So just mix that in. There we go. Set that off to the side. Now we have to do our egg wash. For the egg wash, I use two eggs and a third a cup of milk. We're good on that. Now add the milk. Whisk it up. All right, we have our egg wash ready now, so we're gonna go over to the stove, batter up the walleye, and get her going. All right, we're getting ready to cook our Parmesan crusted walleye. The way we know our pan is hot is we can hear the sizzle from the oil. So right when you hear that, you're ready to go on. Put it in your egg wash. Put some crumbs on it. This is our Parmesan and Ritz cracker mixture. And you always put the fish face down, so the meaty side down. That's the sizzle we want to hear. All right, they've been going about three minutes on this side. Flip them over. Got a nice color to them. Couple more minutes on this and we're ready to go. All right, here's our cheesy potato recipe. What you do to cook it, spray your pan with some Pam. That way it doesn't stick to the bottom. Put in your cheesy potato mixture. Flatten it out. Toss your bacon on top. You don't want to have the bacon too done, otherwise it'll burn in the oven. And then toss your panko on top of that. It's about a half cup of panko. And you put it in the oven at 325 for 45 minutes. All right, we got our cheesy potatoes ready. We got our steamed vegetables ready. Now we got our Parmesan crusted walleye ready. Let's dig in. Doesn't this look amazing? If you're like me, this will be gone in a second. We got Parmesan crusted walleye, we got broccoli and carrots steamed up, and cheesy potatoes with bacon. What more do you want?